everyone welcome to another tutorial in this video we will see how we can export and import a power automate flow uh, between two environments or you can export from one environment and you can share the flow as a package to other environment or other users so that they can import and use it right so let us start now this is my power automate and i have a default environment here and development environment here right so currently i have enabled so uh, default environment and i want to create a new flow so i will go here create new flow and for this demo i will uh, show you how instant cloud flow is created click on instant cloud flow and give a name let's say create quick account for example so i want to create a flow which will create a contact uh, create an account record quickly whenever someone click a button so click on manual trigger flow click create now here add an input as a parameter let's say account name and in the next step connect dataverse right i want to create a an account so using dataverse so choose dataverse microsoft dataverse click an action called as add a new row and when you add a new row it will ask you to provide the entity information or table information i want to use table account so once you choose the account table you have to assign the dynamic field account name so my account name is the mandatory field so i want to assign the account name you can see here this account name is available in the dynamic panel then i will just save it so this is a small example of a button click or manual flow that i want to export from this environment and import in another environment so that the, that target environment can also be uh, able to use this flow right so this is the uh, flow that i have created and if you click on this test let, let me test this uh, by running the uh, test scenario once I, I will run it will ask me to uh, provide the account name because in the next level it will create an account record by taking the input parameter as account name let's say i want to give msft account and click on run flow so once i will click on run flow the flow will trigger and it will create the account record by taking this input parameter right the input parameter is MS msft account so it will create this record right so this account record is created for me now so how so once you have done the flow development how to export this for other users use you can share a flow with other users pro, pro, from your same environment but if you want to export it how to export so click on this my flow click on the three dots and here you will find there is option export click on the export and click on package right so once you click on package uh, you have to provide some basic informations like what is the uh, name of the flow that you want to export you can give it here the name is let's say quick quick create account flow and you can define description here and environment you can specify let's say development okay and here you have to mention whether this flow will be updated in your target environment or it will create a new flow so you have to choose this if you choose create a create as new then when it will be imported in the target environment it will create a new flow in that environment but if you choose update this flow should be there previously so that it will be updated so as this is first time so i want to create as new but when i ex when i will export second time i will choose update right because it will update the existing flow so click on save and this connection every you know flow is connection right you uh, see this dataverse connection should be there so this selected import setup is select during import now click on export now once you click on export the flow will be exported as a package or g file into your desktop or any location that you can choose now you can see here this is imported sorry exported and the name is quick create account flow now i want to switch back to my environment i'll go to development environment and i will import that you can also share this zip file to other uh, users as, as per your choice or other third party vendors like that now i want to import the same flow in this environment right now i will click on import i will go to my flows area 
then i will click on import and i will click on upload to choose the zip file so click on upload so choose the zip file as soon as you choose the zip file it will upload it and you have to fix the connections for this environment right you have to have a connection uh, that is required for the flow right in previous environment i have created a connection to uh, connect dataverse like that you have to create a connection in this environment so here you have to choose whether you want to create new or you want to update as this is a new create a new save and for this select during import this is the connection requirement right you click on during connection and you will see a new connection is available if the connection is not available you can click on create and create a new connection right connection is important to uh, manage flow right now choose this connection click save now both are done click on import right so first you have to choose whether you want to create a new flow or update an existing flow by using this import setup then you have to create a new connection uh, for this environment to connect so once both is fixed then click on import and you will import your zip file or flow uh, in your target environment that is exported in last environment right now you can see all packages resources were successfully imported now you can click on open flow normally the flow that gets imported becomes turned off by default so go to my flow and just refresh this uh, screen and you will see this flow is available now you just click on this three dots and click on turn on if you want to enable it you have to turn on right and you can edit also by using this edit option it is already opening here you can see the same flow is available now you can also test here this flow is disabled right i have already enabled you just refresh this or you can just close this and click on edit from here from the my flow area now here you can also test the flow so this is another environment so and the flow will work uh, the same way that was working in the last environment if you click on test click on manual and give a name let's say soft chief click on run and click on done now you will see the uh, flow is running and it is creating the new row in account entity right you want to see you can go here in the uh, power apps and you can check that now it is success go to the power apps to see the accounts that is created or not right now select the environment environment is selected development go to dataverse tables and in the tables you have to search the account entity account table so click on the account and go to data in this data area you will find your account that is created immediately right because that account has been created as because of the flow testing right so this is the account that is created through the flow so you understand how you can create a flow in one environment and you can export from one environment to another environment to import and test it right so thank you for watching this video Please subscribe this channel if you want more uh, this type of technical videos on Power Platform and Dynamics 365. Thank you guys. See you next time. Thank you.